Looney Farm Guy here, and this is the Samson SG and TGX by Smitty on Farming Simulator 22. This is for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on Fox Farms for this test and demonstration of these two slurry tankers. They are 15.25 megabytes download, eight and seven slots on console. Let's look at them first here under slurry tanks, tools and slurry tanks, and then we'll talk about what you can use them with. Let's look first at the SG-28, $162,000 to purchase. And uh, this is, uh, <clears throat> we have wheel brands, Trailburg, Michelin, Midas, Nokian, and Vertistein Continental PKT Trailburg. So all of those, we do have a couple of choices within these, a wide and standard in Trailburg, Michelin, wide and standard, Midas, uh, oops, Midas is as is, Nokian, we have narrow tires for Nokian. I do believe I have one of them uh, set up for that. We're going to try those out, make sure they don't destroy crops. Vertistein, Continental, BKT, and then Trailburg. So, attacher type, Zerion 3000 or the 4000, 5000. So, the 3000 is a mod that I don't have right now, but I do have a Zerion 4 or 5000, which is the base game class Zerion. Color choices, we have all these choices, $1,000 to change the color to green even, even though it's already green, blue perhaps. Uh, rim color, we have all the choices as well, $1,000 to change that, and the license plate, uh, let's see, license plate, there we go, uh, back only. License plate goes right there. All right, the TGX is a different attacher type, and we'll talk about that. Uh, but wheels, Trailerberg, Michelin, Midas, Nokian has the narrows again. Uh, Vertistein, Continental, BKT, Trailerberg. So Trailerberg, we get a couple of choices. Michelin, a couple of choices. The rest are, yeah, are as they are. Colors again whatever you like and rim colors again same thing thousand dollars each for there and license plate I do believe probably would yeah same place there all right so here's a couple of base models this one here uh, I have it uh, actually I have it set up for the 3000 let's show you what happens anyways If you have a four, uh, this is the four forty-five hundred. It is the base game class tractor. I will show you that right right now, just so you know. <clears throat> Not that far. There it is, the class uh, Zerian. So that's the base game one. Uh, just make sure you don't put weights. If you put weights, it's not going to attach. So no weights on the back. See, there's the uh, ball attacher down right down in there. If we look, it's right down in there. So, but however, I have this one configured to the 3000. And as you come up over here, it says tool is not compatible because you need to choose the slurry tank. There we go. This one. And notice you go down here. It says attach a type. You need to pick the 4000, 5000. And let's just buy that one, actually, whilst we're doing this. And we will show you, because I know I'm going to get asked about it. It says, it won't attach. I get that all the time. So here we go. <clears throat> so no weights on the back. Attacher type is the 4000, 5000. And there we go. See that? Samson Argo, attach. You attach, and it attaches right down in there. Right. So that's that one. Now, the next one you're going to need to download a mod now the mod I have here is the saddle track mod and I will show you that and I do believe the class Zerion saddle track pack and it comes with all these different things so it comes with the tractor 
notice it's a different style of uh, there is the attacher type right back there so <clears throat> you can change your wheel types so forth and so on and we have some but this isn't about well it's kind of about this because you have to have one of these tractors you have to have a saddle track tractor whether it's from this pack or a mod i do believe there's another mod for it and this one as you can see comes with a tanker and a saddle track see this is the this is the one that comes with the the, the mod but now we have a tank specifically built to attach to this particular style of tractor so <clears throat> in order to use this you need one of these and we will show you how that hooks up so this is one of those cases where you need another mod to use another you need a mod to use another mod and there we go it just hooks up just like that <clears throat> now how do you use it well it is a slurry spreader but you have to again attach something to the back to spread your slurry and once we're uh got go through that then we'll show you all the um uh, how they operate but so you're going to need something like this base game this one will work this one should work I didn't try that one but this one I do have in the field demonstrating so we will show you that right okay let's hop into this one we do have some options now let's get our lights on we have lights we have signals we have a beacon let's just hop into this one right now and we will show you uh, show you the lights and beacon oops let's get out of the camera out of the way here there we go and signals so you can see those are basically both the same in that respect actually as a matter of fact they both have the same options so I'm just going to show you this one <clears throat> excuse me right so let's pull up over here and get those lights off now we have a animation I guess you could call it L1 and a, a right stick up and down we have the fill a fill tube that you can pretend to fill up your tanker R1 right stick left and right extends it out and up and down lowers and raises it now L1 and R1 yes so as you can see we can extend that out and in and lower it down and as you can see it will you can pretend to stick it into a pond or something to fill up your tank now that isn't you don't have to use that that's strictly for consoles anyways that is strictly a role play item uh, it doesn't say that it doesn't have anything on the description to say that that's something that you can use with um, maybe a PC pumps or pumps and hoses or something like that but <clears throat> to fill it up you just have to go to uh, to a trigger spot like this for example L3 and you can make, fill it with slurry or digestate right okay so on to the demonstration of it in the field now here we have the standard Zerion one which I think most of you probably would use because the base game tractor is available well with your base game equipment so start the uh, start the worker up here and the worker uh, what's nice about the um, saddle track type or this type of attachment is it's quite maneuverable <clears throat> and um, gives you a much more tighting, t tighter turning radius and we'll watch the uh, computer or the AI driver turn around here
so very efficient turning around no problems whatsoever here and same with the other one let's go over here and start it up let's we have to fold this in order to detach it but I will want to show you that oh capacities yeah we might we might should probably look at that um, it is digested so it does get used up quite quickly 28,000 liters for either one of them so essentially they're both the same so it's just really the style of the tractor so if you get this you can there is really no difference in performance or capacity between the two just um, just the design so let's drop that back so that's how you attach see it is has a three-point type link so as you come up to whatever you want to attach or whatever kind of spreader you want to attach it to there we go the hoses and everything hook up this one also has your uh, adjustable boom and so forth if you want to play around with that like I say quite maneuverable this one has the narrows on it so let's uh, let's drop that let's make sure we have our crop destruction on <clears throat> All right, crop destruction turned on, and let's go. I have narrows on the cloths and narrows on the back of this. And as you can see, all safe for crop roaming around on the crop. So if you uh, you have some crop that um, that has sprouted or whatever, and you still want to spray, uh, put some slurry or digestate down, uh, this is safe for it. Now, just remember, if... Uh, if you have narrows on here make sure you have narrow tires on your tractor if you're doing that otherwise your tractor will destroy the crop but not the 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 the, tre the, the treads on the uh the spreader so just remember that if you're uh, if you have that option and there you have it that's the samson sg and tgx by smeddy for farming simulator 22 thank you all for watching i'm lonely farm guy and remember it's only a game, so till next time, bye for now.